This is Coogan Cassius for I from London. We're at the Millennium Hotel here in Mayfair for Mickey. Let's do a show fighting on the bill tonight. Brad Watson to my left, who just defeated Delroy Spencer. How are you, Brad? Yeah, I'm good, you? Yeah. How did you assess that performance tonight against uh, a man who said about 163 fights? Uh, for me, it was like five, five out of ten. It, by far my poor, poor, most poor, <laughs> poor performance, you know. What was it about it that disappointed you or you were picking out or criticising? You know, I, I haven't felt too great in the camp. I haven't been over to like Paul, my main my main camp. Uh, I've been doing a lot back home. You know, I've just had a baby and that, so I've had to financially support my family. So uh, the camp hasn't gone too great. But um, you know, I'll get straight back out there next week with Paul and look forward to February the twenty third. So you're five and up now, still undefeated. Mm -hmm. um, are you looking this year just to move up the rounds at some point? Ah, uh, yeah. Next one's six threes. Um, and yeah, Mickey's hopefully in March, uh, some sort of title. Nothing big, just like a Masters title, you know. So obviously, um, by all means, you're quite a bit of a superstar where you're from, aren't you? People yeah. tell me. Is that right, yeah. to get mobbed in the streets? Yeah, not not really mobbed, just, you know, yeah, it's only 60,000 people on the island and yeah, everyone knows me and, you know, I've been on that, I've been on that TV documentary, 15 Kids and Count, and you know, I've got a big family. So yeah, quite a few people know me. Have they uh, decided to put up a statue of Brad Watson in Guernsey? Yet? Not, not yet. <laughs> do you want us to campaign for that? Because I can do it. Campaign for it if you want. We'll start on Twitter. Are you on Twitter, Brad? Yeah, I'm on Twitter. What's your Twitter? At Glamourboy211. <laughs> well, we'll start a campaign to get a statue life size, or do you want it a little bit? Would you rather be a bit taller? Uh, a bit taller. Yeah, we can do that. Me and James will do that. We'll get on, work right on that. So hopefully, we'll get 60,000 people in Guernsey that know about iFilm London as well. That's it. What's your next show you were on? You said you're fighting in February, uh, so what show's that? Um, is it Fairham in Portsmouth? Okay. Yeah, straight across the water for my lot, so it'd be like home, really. So, how many fights are you looking to have this year? Well, I've got one in February, so that's six, and one in March, seven. Oh, hopefully, I'll be on ten by the end of the year. Um, you, uh, what's your natural weight? Because I thought it was a weight. You fought tonight at flyweight, didn't you? Yeah, no, um, well, my first two fights were at flyweight, and then, uh, yeah, Mickey, well, the, my other two fights, Mickey told me to come in at like 8-6. Yeah, so I wanted to get back down to Superfly so, you know, I can get up them rankings and, you know, get the title shots when they come. All right, well, listen, congratulations. Like I said, 5-0 and still unbeaten. You're moving forward nicely, so uh, roll on February and try to get out as much as you can, get him rounds up. Yeah, that's it, just get out as much as I can and, yeah. Hopefully. Follow him on Twitter. What is it, Glamour Boy? At Glamour Boy 211. What's 211? Ah, oh, my mates banged up for Big Bird and it was his motocross number and I don't know, we spoke about it and yeah, he was like my best mate at the time. At so the I time? Thought, I thought, yeah, I thought I'd follow his, uh, thought I'd keep his number going. That's all right, could be a lucky number for you. <laughs> this is Kogan Cassius here with Brad Watson for iPhone London. Thank you very much. <laughs>